Genetically modified organisms, or GMOs, usually refers to crops or livestock that have been genetically modified via transgenesis, which is the artificial transfer of a gene from an individual of one species to an individual of a completely different species. GMOs allow for food to be produced more efficiently and with more nutrients. For example, golden rice is a genetically modified rice crop that can help offset vitamin A deficiencies far better than any natural food. GMOs can be designed to be more resistant to disease and pests. Organisms can be genetically altered to be more resistant to insects and disease that would normally be difficult to prevent. Humans have been safely modifying organisms for thousands of years through their use of selective breeding. There is little evidence that transgenesis poses significantly more risk, and it can provide the same benefits of selective breeding in a far shorter period of time. GMOs are relatively new and have had limited independent testing compared to more natural crops. Most GMOs are only a few decades old at most, and many are not subject to specific regulation. GMOs may encourage monoculture. Like most products produced by large companies, GMOs are often standardized. This means that if a disease or other affliction becomes capable of attacking a GMO crop, it would likely wipe out a huge amount, and far more than it would have when each farm's crops were slightly different. However, monoculture may be derived from other economic factors than GMOs alone. GMOs are often created and patented in a way that exploits small farmers. Often GMO crops will not produce seeds, and even if they do, it may not be legal for farmers to reuse them, forcing them to buy new crops from large multinationals like Monsanto every year, as opposed to being able to replant the seeds from last year's crops.